Good morning. It's Saturday, November 6th. I'm in the gallery. Uh, the sun just came up and I want to take on a little tour. Uh, I'll start in the first room with some of my things and then we'll spend most of our time on the work of Sally Ryan, my guest artist for this month. This is a new small one I'm calling Inside the Shell. If you've ever looked inside a conch shell, these are what the uh, colors remind me of. If I could remember what it's like being on a beach. Possibilities, 40 by 30, with all that texture in pink we've seen before. This is my playful trio. I call it playful because it's just an interplay of color and line and texture. Crevice, 36 by 36. And Garden Pop, which is a 40 by 30 which feels to me like the beautiful demise of the garden this season. And I brought this one out again, an American in Paris. It's a 24 by 24. I just love the jazzy feel of this and the colors seem to go. This is my newest one. I keep making small changes and I might make some small changes before you get here. But this is, uh, I call it Love in the Afternoon. Terrible movie, great title. Combination of acrylics and ink. And you can see some of the detail. Okay. So let's turn to Sally, who clearly favors the complementary blue and yellow palette that I also love, and whose mark making scribbles really add a lot of beautiful detail. This is a trio, Hope for a Better Future. I'm not making it up, that's what it's called. And they could be sold as a group. I would buy them as a group, but they could also be broken up. Sally incorporates a lot of collage technique along with the painting. And we'll take you a walk through room two. Here's a 36 by 36 called Lily Pond. All you Monet fans can see why. charming smaller piece and this one is called Gorge Walk a title which is very dear to my heart as you those of you who follow me know but you can really see the slabs of shale and the water there are two more the one on the left really feels like a signature piece to me it's the combination if you squint you can almost see koi in the water but then you get closer and you realize it's combination of small and large elements. I love this one. And a smaller 24 by 24, which incorporates a lot of collage. And finally, two very bold color field paintings. Uh, reminds me of uh, some of Hans Hoffmann's palettes. And just because I can, showing off my new storage unit with almost everything I've done, <laughs> just a feature of the gallery. So as you can see, we are full of color and texture. If you didn't get a chance to come last night, which was a great party, uh, stop by today. We're here from 11 to 4. You can always contact either Sally or me to make an appointment to drop by during the month. Thanks for watching.